Coffee Chat Day 33, I think. Yeah, Day 33, yeah. Sit down, grab yourself a coffee, enjoy the vibe. I got new shoes. They're platform converse. I'm a little bit taller now. And they go better with uh, this outfit that I'm wearing because it's got like these uh, more natural colors other than the blood red of my other shoes. So hell yeah, we're, we're kicking. We're kicking. We got new kicks. So yeah, not much to... I mean, there was a fair bit to talk about today. Uh, went to the gym, obviously. I mean, I was meant to go yesterday, but I just didn't because yesterday I was really exhausted. So I just slept all day. But uh, yeah, no, today, it, it, it's been different. It's been different today. I'm actually, like, I'm feeling good today. I mean, yesterday was kind of mediocre, we'll just say. But, like, you know, you not every day can be the best day, right? Like, it, not every day can be exceptionally good. So, you know, you just gotta, gotta take what you get. And, you know, not every day should be good. That's, that would be boring if every day was just incredible. You'd get bored of it. You need to have some bad days in there. But, uh, yeah, no, so I went to the gym, had a good day. Had a good workout. I mean, I only did four exercises, but I need to get home early enough to, you know, fully clean these. Because I'm going out tonight. And, uh, yeah. But, you know, like, besides the quick workout, it was fun. Like, I had a good time. I got a new predicted one rep max of 87. Which means, well, 87 kilos on bench, I should say. So... New predicted one rep max, 87 kilos on bench, and that's got me feeling good. That's got me feeling very excited, because that means I'm probably going to end up repping 80 pretty soon. I also really annoyed my friend earlier, so I'm very happy I did that. <laughs> Uh, I was coming back from the gym, and I went up to where he works before going to the gym, right? Because he works in the shop that's closest to where I live. I went there, got myself a Monster for the pre-workout drink. Uh, and I told him, once I'm coming back from the gym, I'm gonna drop on by, I'm gonna drop off a rollie to him, right? Because, you know, like he, like his work shifts are not very good, they're not very forgiving, so it's like, uh, he, like, he needs something, right, like, I'm gonna give him something, you know, keep him, keep him in good, in good spirit, hopefully, so I told him I'd drop off a rollie to him after the gym, you know, drop, I did that, uh, but it was rush hour when I was dropping it off, so I was just in line with a rollie, just waiting for my turn to get up to him, and he was just like, all right, come on, you need to leave now. <laughs> if that's all you're doing, then you need to leave. But, you know, like, I'm still gonna, I'm a man of my word, I'm still gonna drop off the rollie. So that's what I did. Uh, after that, took a shower, uh, read the Bible, now we're here. I've been experimenting with taking notes when I'm doing, like, the daily Bible reading. Just so I can have my thoughts, like, a little bit more constructed I guess uh, so what I'm gonna be doing for that daily Bible reading thing is before I start recording the coffee chat I'm gonna read through what verses I'm gonna need to read through and then I'm just gonna take notes so right here since we're reading uh, Genesis 15 and 16 today uh, but I'm not uploading 16 until tomorrow I got some notes on Genesis 15. I couldn't really, like nothing really caught my eye on Genesis 16 other than, you know, what was explicitly said. So, you know, I'm just gonna emphasize those when I'm reading through it. But uh, here we got the notes for Genesis chapter 15. 
Don't know if you can read them, but we got some good ones there. So yeah, I'm feeling pretty good today about the Bible reading because I want to put more effort into it because I feel like if I'm just reading through it and then just like waffling after it feels very disingenuous and it's like I want to understand the word better. I want to help other people understand the word better too. So hopefully I'll be able to do that a little bit more efficiently now. I mean, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say for like today, right? I was gonna write a poem uh, during this video, but I, I mean, I probably could, but it would be very disinteresting, not disinterest, It'd be very not interesting for you guys at home because I'm just gonna be like sitting here reading out what I'm saying and like trying to write something poetic and beautiful and whatever. And it's just not going to be a very fun thing to watch. I mean, not that I'm saying this is very fun to watch, but it would be a lot less fun than this, you get me? The coffee tastes really good. And I like that I can hear the birds too. I'm going to be seeing one of my friends that I haven't seen in like nearly seven months now today. And I'm very excited for that. Going to see how he's been keeping. And yeah, it's going to be a good time, hopefully. I mean, again, these are recorded a day in advance, so all of this is going to be happening yesterday. So, tough luck for you if that's something that you care about if you care about keeping up to my keeping up with my life on the day of because that's just not happening another thing I want to do is I want to live stream again live streaming was very fun I'll probably I could probably live stream a video game like honestly if you guys want that because a lot of people were saying during the live stream that I should live stream games and uh I might because like honestly live streaming is very fun even with like just the very few people that we have there that we had there last time we only had like at the peak 13 viewers right but man it was fun like the the chat was like really good and like I'm pretty sure I've said this before but I was very anxious about going live because it was like I'm not I wasn't sure if I was gonna have fun with it but I had a lot of fun with it so I might end up doing it again I know like let me know if you want me to like start live streaming games because like it would be very fun the only problem is the laptop that I have right now isn't that powerful so I might end up saving up for a new laptop and then once we get like a stronger you know like processing and all that once like we're actually capable of live streaming games then it would be very fun then it'd be very fun to do that not sure how it's gonna fit in the schedule though because the thing is like I feel like we have a very, I feel like we have a good branding thing going with this channel. Like, you know, there's three sort of series that really, well, there's three series on this channel, right? There's the, there's these videos, there's the Bible readings, and then there's the sort of advice slash wisdom kind of videos, right? And it's like, you know, having those three feels very good like it feels very focused right like all of them sort of work together to create this channel 
and I'm very happy that I have all three of them. But I'm not sure where gaming is is gonna fit in that cycle, other than like, you know, a, a live coffee chat where we end up playing a game as like another thing to sort of focus on. Actually, that's pretty good. That'd be pretty good. Like, imagine playing Minecraft and we just, like, have a coffee chat going. And, like, we're all on a server or something. That'd be sick. Actually, that might be... That might be it. I think we figured out a way to fit it in. I don't know. Let me know. Let me know. <laughs> just gonna tally that smoke there. Alright, on to the coffee since the smoke's dead. This video's gonna be a bit longer, hopefully. Because I've been saying it before, right? Like, these coffee chats have been feeling a lot shorter recently. I kind of want to keep them, like, a little bit longer. You know, like, just have more fun, have more time to, like, just speak and, like, have this sort of vibe going. Because this vibe is, like, a very fun thing for me, especially. Like, I hope you guys like it too, but this is just really fun for me to do as well. Because I've always liked coffee. I've liked coffee since I was around 14. I've always been a big fan of it. So, you know, being able to sit down, have a coffee, and just talk is very fun. Even if, like, no one else is in the room with me and it's just me and the camera... I'm still just able to talk, and it feels like we have a very good flow to it. Because I've always been sort of one for talking to myself when I'm alone. Because it's like, I know me better than anyone else does. Well, besides God. But I know me more than the people that I know know me. So why would I not have a conversation with myself every now and again? Just to like, you know, keep up with myself, treat myself like a friend, you know, like all that sort of stuff, right? Because that is like something I feel a lot of people struggle with is treating themselves like a friend. And I might end up making a video on that because we're getting near to the end of like all the pre-recorded sort of advice videos. So for the new batch I'm gonna be making, I'll probably end up talking about that because the new batch of videos I wanna make, I'm very excited for. Cause I feel like I've learned a lot since I recorded the old batch. And I want to like really push out the current sort of wisdom that I have into those videos. Because I feel like this, the sort of stuff that I know now is a lot more positive than the stuff that I knew back then. And like, you know, it, I know life isn't always like sunshine and flowers. But the sort of thoughts that I've been having and the sort of things that I've been thinking about over the past month they feel very positive. They feel like stuff that could genuinely encourage people to be more positive. And I really want to, like, bring that out and really, like, try and just put out some good stuff in, the, in this world. Like, put out some good energy. Because the world today is just really negative. And I want to, like, do my part to fix that. Like, I want to... Be a light of positivity. And you know, just... I just sort of want to help people... Learn to like... Enjoy life. And like... You know, to love each other. Rather than just always being in this sort of... Hostile towards everyone else sort of thing. Because I've been there, like, I've been that person who was hostile to everyone, including myself. And it's not fun, like, it really isn't. And it takes a lot to, like, get out of that. Like, usually when you get to that point, you're already very much struggling with, like, mental health sort of problems, right? So, 
I don't know. It's like, it's a very complicated place to be. But I hope by that by just talking about all this more positive stuff, I'll be able to help people in those situations. And another thing I want to do is I want to be like a lot more real to that. Like I want to acknowledge that negative stuff and then turn it into something positive. Because that just feels like the right way to tackle the problem, you get me? Coffee done. So yeah, that's everything I have to say today. Keep running when no one else is. I'll see you in the next one.